Eyewitness Weather Forecast. Well, good morning. After a chilly and a frosty start to the day, we're looking at plenty of sunshine and a beautiful afternoon that's ahead of us. Here in Scranton, atop Montage Mountain, it is a very nice end to the morning with plenty of blue sky, not a cloud to talk about. Now, eventually, we'll get some cloud cover to mix back in, but that'll be a little bit later on. Temperatures are sitting in the 40s, 50s, and even the 60s right now, so a good wide range in that temperature. Mount Pocono at 55, Hazleton we're at 61, Williamsport at 45, and Pottsville we're ending our morning right around 51. Here's satellite and radar and there's really not much to talk about. Further to our north there's some more cloud cover and even a couple of showers up near Syracuse, but that's where a lot of that will be staying as we go through the rest of today. We really as of now don't even have a cloud to talk about, but eventually that is going to change. This area of high pressure is giving away just enough space that this cold front can start to move in a little bit later on. But notice right along that front, there's not a lot of rain, not a lot of moisture in the atmosphere to make that happen. So what we'll see is just a little more cloud cover. And then the temperature today will top off in the mid 60s. The average high for this time of year is right around 58. There will be spots, northern tier, higher elevations. We all know who we are that stay a little bit cooler, but still very nice no matter what way we slice it. And then we're going to drop into the 50s this evening and down to about the mid 40s tonight. Not quite as chilly as what we had through this morning. But there's that area of high pressure giving enough space. There's the cold front that'll start to at least approach today. Tonight going into tomorrow that passes through as it does. So we get some more cloud cover tomorrow and future cast is even trying to hint at a couple of pop up showers, though it does look like those will be decently isolated. Going into Saturday, there's actually a quick little weak area of high pressure that builds in right in the middle of the day. Now it's quick to start moving out of here by the evening and depending upon the speed that that gets out of here will determine when this rain is allowed to move in. Right now, it looks like that holds off until Saturday night going into Sunday as all of this moves through, but there will be some heavier pockets of rain right in the middle of Sunday afternoon. But the timing on that Still a little bumpy. I want to keep checking back for updates as we get closer to the weekend. 64 for the high today in your eyewitness weather forecast. We are mostly to partly sunny and it's warmer. Just a beautiful fall day down to 46 for the night tonight. Partly cloudy. It's not quite as cool as we're waking up tomorrow morning compared to the 30s that we all saw this morning. 60 tomorrow afternoon, more cloud cover, and we'll even watch for those pop-up showers. Saturday will start with a little sun, then the clouds take over at 58. The rain as of now holds off until Saturday night going into Sunday, but if that high speeds up a little bit, that rain will try to sneak in as early as Saturday evening. Monday, we're drying out near 60. Same thing on Tuesday, just fighting with a little cloud cover, and then by Wednesday, we get a little more rain right around 58 and the eyewitness weather app can always be downloaded on your phones and tablets. The forecast is always available for you at pahomepage.com. Chris, it's a great day to get the car washed, which is something I have to do really, really bad. <laughs> there you go. So a nice day for that. But you know, it, it was like you said, it was so chilly this morning. It's nice to see on the seven day. Yes. That's not the new normal. At least things are a little more mild <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> uh, for the time being. That is yes. thanks. Stephanie. Well, another